<laughs> all right, so the reason that you clicked on this video is because you jump shot it. It's just broke, man. It's broken beyond all repair. It's FUBAR. F***ed up beyond all recognition. That's what it is, man. But I'm here to help you. I'm going to be here all year dropping the best jump shots, the best ones, the easiest ones, the stuff that people don't want y'all to know about, the stuff that ain't meta, man. I already gave y'all my best jump shot. Uh, look, man, that James Harden jump shot, what I told y'all the other time, don't judge me. I was using that jumper. Bro, that thing took me from, uh, I don't know what it was. I think it was like, I don't know what my percentages were, bro. But my, uh, my three-point percentage went up to like 40% now. So like I'm I'm getting there and I started out at like 30%. That thing took me up. Oh, I said I told y'all I had I told y'all I had the sweat the friends that are sweat boxes, right? I told y'all I had them sweat box friends. Look, the James Harden joint raised my three-point percentage by 10% already. And we not even done. It's just gonna keep going north, man. And it's like it was already so low that I'm surprised. That, is, that it is where it is right now, man. So if y'all do nothing else, man, make sure y'all like the video because like I said, I'm gonna keep dropping the best jump shots for y'all all year. Also, you might wanna stick around to the end of the video because tomorrow we're giving away a, um, we're giving away a $50 card for a $50 worth of VC, man. So that's 200,000 VC, man. So make sure you like the video, comment on the video, all that good stuff, man. I'm gonna tell y'all what to comment down there. Uh, but first I'm gonna show y'all this jump shot and then the people that hang around, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna um we gonna do that. So check it out. This is the uh this is it right here. I done made a few jump shots, man, but this is it right here, man. If y'all wanna just copy it down and get up out of here, you need something that's a little bit slower. Uh that's it. Clyde Drexler Bass, Shea Julius Alexander, and Paul George. 67 toward Shea uh Julius Alexander, 33 to Paul George. If you go down one, it'll be all A's. Uh, and, and you know, you get an A minus or whatever, obviously for the speed. If you mess with any of this stuff over here, you might lose something. So, so that's what I'm saying. 67 and what's it called? See, you see how it how dramatically it changes if you mess with things. So that's why I leave it where it's at 67 and, um, 67 and 33. Uh, one, two, see, we only get three out of whatever over here. So. That's why I'm saying put it on, uh, put it all the way up. Now, if you have a 6'3 guy or something like that, you got a 6'3 guy or something uh, on the 6'5, you get four. So you can actually go down one tick and then put your jumper on very fast or up tick on the jumper. But this is why I got it like this, man. This is a super dope jumper. And like I said, anybody can use it. You just need an 80, you just need an 84 three ball or better. And you gotta be 6'5", between 6'5 and 6'10", man. And I'm 6'7", so I can do that right there. And most of the community is six, uh, it's like that also, bro. So let's, um, I hate when you go and look at a jump shot and save and come back out. Also, man, shooting tip number one, every single time you get ready to play, bro, make sure this is off because if I am mistaken, we actually did something and it was like, if, you, if your controller comes out and it goes back in, that that will change. This stuff changes, bro. Like I'm gonna unplug my controller. I don't know, bro. My boy Galaxy was playing, and and uh, I passed him the ball. We was in the wreck, bro. I passed him the ball two or three times in the wreck. He shot. It was green. And then the second half, it was like uh no, don't want to quit to the main menu. Then in the second half, what happened? His shot meter just came on or whatever. I was like, bro, that's that's insane. His shot meter was on, and uh. And his jump shot had changed. So make sure y'all check your jump shot and all of that before every single game. That's tip number one. Tip number two, watch the animation the whole way through. Don't, don't hey, look, look, don't, 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 don't judge me if I miss a couple of shots in here, man, because like I said, I've been using James Harden. This is a new one for me to give y'all. James Harden is faster than this one, but um, it's hard to talk to y'all and shoot at the same time, okay? The tail right above his, is right above his head, man. Right above his head or when the elbow cocks and you're good to go. But um, yeah, it's it's a little bit, this is a little bit slower than James Harden, so I'm gonna be shooting it early, but I just wanted to get y'all something that's good. But that's why I say you gotta watch the animation the whole way through. You watch the animation the whole way through, then you'll be able to hit way more shots. So right here, I'm gonna watch it all the way through. I know where it goes, bang. So watch it the whole way through. Make sure you're checking your stuff every time because, bro, I ain't gonna lie, I can't tell you how many times I've gone in and then you come out and your meter's on. And like the guys that use the meter, 
y'all are especially susceptible, especially susceptible to this because we don't. If you don't use meter, you know as soon as you shoot it, um, you know that that oh my oh my settings my settings went back right. You'll know that immediately. But if you do use meter, you won't know it until after you shoot about two or three shots. And you're gonna say, man, dang, this is on uh, this is on this is not on what I left it on. But uh, anyway, this shot is a little bit slower than James Harden. I like the I like the speed of James Harden, but it, but some people ask me. They say, "Hey man, you know we don't want to shot." Another another thing, like there's also several different animations. So that's the fast animation right there. So I, I had to let it go. You got to know the animation as soon as it goes. You get a slow animation and a fast animation. Most of it is dictated by where the guy catches the ball. So if you got the ball and it's here, you're gonna get the slow animation. If you get the ball and he catches up here. You're gonna get the fast animation. It should be pretty intuitive, but not everybody knows it. But the big thing is, as soon as that ball get above his head, as soon as it gets right here to his face, just go ahead and let it go. And you're gonna hit shots all day long. Probably my third shooting tip, man, is uh, you gotta know when you open, man. If you shooting the ball and you don't see the guy bearing down on, you don't see those two red rings, then you know that, uh, then that's how you can tell that you open. But like I said, the main thing is, just try to take open shots. Uh, on this game, shooting is already at a premium anyway. So with shooting being at the premium, like I said, don't don't judge me if I'm missing some shots, man. I'm talking. I like to see y'all boys talk and, and shoot at the same time. But with shooting being at a premium already, uh, these shots, you got to make sure you're taking, taking good open shots. Yeah, also shooting off the dribble, man. Like the time, let's just be real. The timing is crazy. It's, it's different from Gatorade to, to practice. It seems like it's different from Gatorade to practice to uh to the to the league to the rec. It's like everywhere is different, and literally every shot is different. But the main thing is every shot is different, but it's really just two speeds. So the shot, every shot gonna look different, but it's just two speeds. So if you can see it when he gets it to his forehead, you start letting it go. Um, that's why you gotta watch just the slow and not let it go early. Um you watch the animation all the way through and you can tell which one you're going to get fast one. And I knew I was going to get the fast one because he brought it up to his side, right? And then, like I said, the other one is the slow one when he brings it up. That's the slow one because he brought it up from his, all the way from his uh, knees or whatever. So, like I said, man, hopefully you guys enjoy this video and hopefully this helps y'all a lot. The Clyde Drexler jump shot, like I said, I used it for a good amount of time. Uh, the James Harden, the James Harden is just faster. Like, that's, that's the only reason I use it. It's faster but both of them are equally reliable. But I just feel like this is a base that like, I would use the Clyde Drexler first. This is a good beginner jump shot because it's slower. And then I would graduate to the James Harden. Once you start catching up with Clyde Drexler because it's an A, then you can use the, then you can use James Harden because James Harden, I knew I, I knew that was late. James Harden is an A plus. And um, actually, I didn't know that was late, man. It shouldn't even, like, why you do the, why you do the green animation that it say early 2K, bro? That's why we know the 2K be hustling us, man. So y'all don't even worry about this stuff. Shoot the ball. Like, if I, I'm a catch and shooter, so I don't shoot off the drill. This is what I do. I catch and shoot. So like I said, man, make sure y'all watch the animation all the way through. Make sure your stuff is on. That's the fast one. Make sure your stuff is on. Watch the animation all the way through. And then, uh, and also just know when you open. But like I said, if you don't see the circles uh, in front of your feet, where where um, if it doesn't show up where, where like restricting where you can go, you know what I'm saying, like the shading. If you don't see that pop up, you're open. Fire that thing, man. Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, leave a gem star down in the comment section if you made it this far, man. Let me know the jump shot worked for you. That's the slow one and I let it go early. Um, I tell you, I can call it. I can call it. That's the slow one, and I let it go on time. But it's, it just didn't let it turn. Uh, let me know what you think down in the comment section. I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Until next time. Like I said, bro, I'm a little bit tired. I've been all day. I had a, I had a network go down, and I've been dealing with it all day, man. I am sorry. I ain't the most enthusiastic. But, hey, leave me a jump start down in the comment section, and you'll be entered in the in the uh, joint tomorrow. Uh, it's gonna be it's gonna we're gonna give away fifty dollars worth of VC tomorrow, man. And we're gonna do it live on stream. So make sure you comment on this video and all the videos from this week. Leave a like on the video. And I'm gonna holler at y'all next time, man. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barber Shop, BK of the People's Champ. Guys, speak. Guys, speak.